Welcome back to One Hour Limit Locked, where I race to complete some of RuneScape's most iconic challenges, whilst limited to just one hour of gameplay each day. In Season 1, we got ourselves a fire cape in 46 days, and in Season 2, we achieved Barrow's Gloves in just another 38. But now, in Season 3, it's time for our toughest challenge yet. The question is, how many days will it take us to complete our first ever raid on the account? We not only have to get ourselves geared and leveled up just to step inside a raid, we then have to complete it in under one hour, as logging out in the middle will end our run. I've no idea how long this is going to take me, but I can't wait to find out, so join me for the journey here in Season 3 of One Hour Limit Locked, as we become a Tomb Raider. What is good, people? It's episode 52 of the third season. We are diving straight on into it. And I am raring to go, apparently, according to me just now. Don't know how accurate. Got two dueling rings. Kiss man's overprepared. I know we're in a bit of a grindy phase at the minute. And sorry, because it's carrying on. Need to get these magic levels. There's no other way to do it. Well, there are other ways I could do it, but none of them are anywhere near as efficient as this is. So this is the quickest way to do it, and it makes more sense to me to not have to keep swapping on and off ancients and just to stay on them. Probably do with a little rune top up before we go out. We should be due 73 today and a good bit of the way to 74. Don't think we'll get 69 defense though, but we should be very close to that as well by the end of the session all being well and who knows maybe we even do manage to see our third zombie axe and yes you got bared by my thumbnail and tile yesterday if you watched that one there was no third axe <laughs> that was the one from the uh the day before it was literally the same screenshot why have i got runes i don't need runes i need tablets Oh, I forgot the seeds! What's wrong with me? It's a good job I went to one that was right next to a bank by accident. Why do I have air runes? <laughs> oh, this is the one I forgot to compost. See how bad this works out. Is it gonna have died? Is it gonna have survived and only give us two aventures? Yeah, it died. <laughs> uh, that one's on me. That one's on me. I didn't want to make the journey right back out here just to compost it after we'd already finished yesterday. About 54 farming. How about that? Pretty good time today for the run. Did have one less to harvest mind, but happens sometimes anyway, so. I went to, I'd keep doing this because it's the grand exchange as the default. Okay, not used to using tablets, that's what it is. Right, let's get our shit on the GE. Got shit from yesterday too. Bosh bosh bosh. Man, using a lot of prayer pots, aren't we? Oops. Why have I got so many offers of the same things? My gosh, they're so low at the minute. That's ridiculous for an ours. Right, let's top up on our runes. We'll get a few thousand more. Okay, I don't want to get too many, but we can always sell back what we do use. Okay, topped up a bit there. We want an extra Varrock Telly. The minute the daily, daily herb runs are basically paying for our rune costs. But then we also have the profit coming in from the zombies ourselves, which is also sort of the same amount as daily herbs. Axes aside, that is. Go take four with me, see if I can make the first trip a little longer if my invent doesn't fill up with crap. Okay. Ah, uh, home again. Guess I'll see you guys when something interesting happens. Might get a hit points level today, actually. It's saying 35 minutes. Defense, not likely, but we will be close. Magic, definitely. Soon. And there's another one, baby! 
There is another one. We don't even have the inventory space for it. Fucking hell. What the fuck? Three in 1266. An extra two mil in the pocket. I'm gonna have to leave our... There's too much shit starting to spawn. Okay, I'm gonna do a little bit of an irrit drop. Grab these and then hope the irrits are still there by the time I come back. We're absolutely printing gold. We're gonna be over 10 mil soon and we've still got seven and a half fucking mil in miscellanea. Three prayer pots is definitely the way to go though. I don't know why I was bringing a fourth that time. Wow. What a fucking show. See, now I can't bait it in the thumbnail, because it actually happened. Now if I bait it in the thumbnail, nobody will click in the video, and, the, and then they'll they'll miss the actual third zombie axe, because I baited it in the previous one. Who cares, man? We've made seven mil from these armoured zombies. Granted, we've probably spent about one and a half mil on runes, but we we're going to be doing that regardless. We would have spent the same amount if we were doing it at the Monkey Madness Tunnels. Oh, look at that, my ear it stayed around. This is why I am the one man hour. The one hour man himself, the one man hour. <laughs> Sounds like a shit comedy stand up special. I am one hour man. Somebody commented that on one of my posts when my computer was dead and I don't know. Made me feel kind of special being known as one hour man in the RuneScape community. Maybe I should put it on my Tinder profile, I might actually get some matches. And there's 73 magic. Roughly an hour on the clock to the next level, so... We'll be at least halfway towards it by tomorrow. Two more levels to go, we are very almost done with our magic grind. It hasn't taken us that long. This is our fourth day here, so... Two more days maybe, six days, to get five magic levels, and a lot of money. Not too bad. Of course, the exponential mechanics in RuneScape, every level you go up, the next one is just that much further away than the last one was. So going up from 70 to 75 takes a lot longer than going up from 65 to 70, for example. Uh, I feel like 70 is where it starts becoming actually really noticeable the difference between each level that's just me personally i don't know if there's any like math that makes that track it's just how i feel once you get past 70 you're like damn this is starting to become a slog so these magic levels have come in very quick is what i'm saying six days five levels is uh, not bad at all you always got to keep in mind when I say days, it doesn't mean actual days, it means one hour sessions. <laughs> you could do this in an afternoon. <laughs> I've just realised I missed it, my I hasn't been on. I wonder why my prayer was going down on my in was barely going down and my invent had filled up. I fucking hate it when I do that, you lose so much DPS. Fuck, I'm out of space already. I only just got here. Oh, we've lost aggro, maybe it's a good time to bank. Got anything for me, bud? Nope. Yeah, honestly, I'm just gonna take one lobster. They get dropped for invent space, like nine times out of 10. Every now and then I panic eat one if my health slips to like 20, but barely ever happens. What? What? Why do I feel like we've had one of these before? What was that on my main? I can't remember. Not a zombie one, but a different one. It might have been on my main account. What the hell? I'm gonna have to look up the drop rate for this thing. Even though you can get it from the one in 5,000. I mean, I suppose we have killed a few thousand, so it's... Or uh, over a thousand, so... One in five people at my kill count would have it. Not too unreasonable, but still. That's crazy, man. You don't see them too often. The old champion scrolls. What do we actually get for doing it is the question. Might be a lamp. I need to make sure I don't accidentally die while I'm looking all this shit up. Oh, you get fuck all. You get 2,400 Slayer and a hit point 6B, which is equivalent to approximately 10 bursts, maybe. I, I, I'm not actually sure it's worth the time for us. Pretty sure it's untradeable though. Yeah, it's not tradable. I don't feel like it's worth the time to go and do the fight, honestly. Because we don't need Slayer or 
2,000 hit points XP, you know, we can spend our time in better ways, but interesting drops I have on the account nonetheless, the old champion scroll. I will have to check at the end of the session in my collection log if it is this account that I had another one on or if it was on my other one. It could have even been in league or something. Oh, we've de aggroed again. Finish this stack and then I'll get one more trip. We should just be able to squeeze that health level in. It's saying 8 minutes on the clock. Got 8,690. 6 XP to go. A zombie and champy scroll in the pocket. Not quite as good rates today as our last couple of days. Respectable still, but I don't know. Something I've been I've been doing something wrong, obviously, because the rates aren't as good. Whatever it is, they're, they're still, you know, exceptional. Just not as nuts as they were yesterday. At least not the minute. Maybe it's been more trips. I think this is four trips we've made today, so I guess that cuts into our rates a bit. Just depends how quick your invent fills up and... Yeah, because I've banked every time that I've de-aggroed today, because my invent's been full at the same time. Whereas previous days I was getting in sometimes, like, one de-aggro and I'd reset it and then stay till the next one. Or until I filled up a bit into the next one at least. Because I feel like I've been stacking them pretty good today, like, I've been pretty consistent just running around this corner. Are there 74 hit points, 89 combat? I think we will be 75 hit points by the time we go into raids, more than likely, based on the way things have been going the past couple days, and, you know, we've got a couple more days left. Maybe even just one more day, to be honest. Because if we're doing, I'm, I think I'm just going to do Major Arena 1 before the entry level. And then Major Arena 2 might be something I'll do before normal. There's going to be like two periods, basically. One where, like we've got two thresholds. We've got an entry level threshold and a normal threshold. And the entry level is like base 70s. The normal is base 75s, effectively. I mean, obviously higher than that would be better, but those are the requirements for the setups that we want to use. We got enough money for whatever now, so we can use whatever money we have the levels for. Uh, whatever setup we have the levels for. Money is not an issue. Like, don't get me wrong, we're not wearing third age, but we're not wearing shite either. To be honest, I was trashing my XP rates before, but they haven't even been that bad. I think we got 185k yesterday, so we're not that far behind what we got yesterday. It looked a lot worse 10 minutes ago, but I guess that was 10 minutes ago. Maybe I should not be judging how well my day's gone when my day hasn't finished yet. Just gonna stay another minute or so, let my prayer run down, and then mosey on out of here. I would like to try and make sure I get my axe on the G. I we might have de as well, that guy doesn't seem interested in hitting me. Pretty good timing. Oh, that one's fresh, we don't need to bother with him. P pretty damn good day, I said we got eight, 185 yesterday, we got 182 today. I didn't actually do anywhere near as, as bad as I was talking it to be. Okay, let's get the axe, that's the most important thing. We'll get the Varrock Telly and then we'll get that up and then see if we have time to get the other stuff up. There we go. Extra two mil in the pocket. Got cosmic runes too, don't we? We keep getting tons of them. Oh, not that many. Thought we had a lot more than that. Wait, did I cancel that by accident? Oh man, I had them all in and then I, I cancelled one by accident. <laughs> what an idiot. What an idiot. Oh well. Alright, let's just have a look at this cash stack, because we've already sort of talked about the XP. It's similar sort of breakdown ratio-wise to the past couple of days. But we did get 73 magic, and we're halfway to 74. So we should be at 74 along the way to 75 tomorrow. It's possible that we will only be doing the one more day. Because we need... I believe we have to, like, cast spells a hundred times. Maybe that's for Major Arena 2. No, we don't actually need to cast them. I think that's for the second part that you have to have them unlocked. 
Okay, so we yeah, we'll, we'll go in here to 75 magic and then grabbing our magic cape because it will take us a very long haul. It'll take like 10 minutes to grab that cape, maybe 15. So yeah, we, we will be doing two more days still at the zombies, but then we are out of there and we should have our defense levels clocked in by then as well, hopefully. If not, we'll be very, very close. So yeah, solid day there. Cash stack is looking very nice indeed. We've got nine million plus seven so about 16 mil not bad at all why don't we just have a look how much these are that's too much what about zami hasta see we can afford that that is very good and then we could also get ourselves one of these which will make our bolts go a lot, lot further. I know we've got the blowpipe, but you kind of want a crossbow and a blowpipe for tombs. So why not bring both? We have the money for it. And then what about the blood moon? What's that at the minute? Ooh, 2.6 mil. It's gone down a little from when I last checked. The tacits, on the other hand, are 8 mil. So we're not going anywhere near those. Yeah, things are going well, guys. Hope y'all continue to enjoy it. I'm going to wrap it up real quick. Please leave a like and a comment and subscribe and all that good stuff. But I need a shit. So yeah, until next time, look after yourselves. Be lovely to one another. See you on the next one.